Hey everybody, I am back today to do a tag video. I hope everyone's doing good and that you all have enjoyed your weekend. I was tagged by two lovely YouTube ladies, Curly Girl Jess and Tasty Redbone. Hey y'all! Um, so let's get started. This is the I Love Fall Tag, the natural hair edition. So um, first question, what is your username and what where are you from? Um, my username is Curly Pad. I kind of told this story before in the name tag video that I did, but basically my username came from um, my boyfriend gave me an iPad for our anniversary and my old YouTube account had sometime, somehow got deleted, so I was so excited about my new iPad that I um, made a new account called CurlyPad, so um, that's where my username came from, and um, let's see, where are you from? I am from Hampton, Virginia. Born and raised Hampton, Virginia, and right now I am living in D.C. So um, I'm back home right now, though. This is my apartment back home. And since it's kind of like a temporary job situation, um, I have my apartment back here in Hampton. And I also um, live in a townhouse with a lovely couple from Nepal in um, Alexandria, Virginia. So, um, but home is Hampton. Home is 757. So let's see, um, what is your favorite cold weather protective style? Well, if you guys know, you know that I love protective styles. I pretty much protective style um, about 70% of the time, even when the weather is nice. Um, this summer I experimented a ton more of wash and goes, which I absolutely loved. But um, I'm mostly a protective style girl at heart, braids and twists. So I would definitely say that between braid outs and twist outs and braids and twists themselves, um, more so now these days, twists are my favorite cold weather protective style. Um, how does your hair regimen change in the cold weather? It doesn't really change too much. Um, even in like spring and summer, I make sure that I deep condition every time that I wash my hair. I don't really do like rinse out conditioners. I always deep condition my hair no matter what. Um, and I always like seal my hair with a butter and um, do the protective style thing. So it doesn't really change too drastically when the weather gets cold. Um, I am no noticing this year that um, I really do need to up my moisturization game a little bit. Uh, my hair probably after like seven days has started to get a little drier than it did in the summertime. So I definitely need to use um, some nice like water-based refreshers a little bit more often like nice creamy uh, leave-in conditioners on my hair. So I'm probably going to start to do that soon making sure that I add some type of like refresher or something to my hair after like a week or so. But other than that it's pretty much the same as in the summertime. Uh, let's see. Favorite returning fall TV show? Um, I'm definitely excited about The Vampire Diaries. Definitely love that show. Top Chef is back on. I'm a huge Top Chef fan. And the um, season, the 10th season just premiered, so I'm loving that. Um, Revenge, Once Upon a Time. Love that show. And um, I feel like I'm, oh, The Walking Dead. I'm so excited about The Walking Dead. This season is really, really good so far. So those are probably my favorite fall TV shows that I can think about off the top of my head. I'm a big Netflix person too, so I'm always like discovering new shows on there. But um, as far as the new shows, oh, and Scandal. Love Scandal. So, um, yep, those are my favorite fall TV shows. Uh, favorite fall accessories for hair. Um, I actually was trying to show you guys one, but uh, where is it? I don't know. I love satin scrunchies. I love satin scrunchies. There's nothing like exciting or cute or glamorous about them really, but my hair really thrives with using like satin based accessories. So, and I do a ton of buns in the fall as well. So I like satin scrunchies and I also like these little um, curvy clip thingies. I like to use these for buns and also for like half up half down styles as well. So um, those are definitely it. I love the look of like beanies and like berets. Well, not berets, but like those cute slouchy beanies, but I have like a big head and a lot of hair, so hats look kind of funny on me, but I am um, definitely interested in getting like a satin lined hat this year. I saw a couple of sites on Etsy that sell um, satin lined hats for those big headed folks like myself with a lot of hair, so I'm thinking about getting myself one of those. Um, very soon. My birthday is today actually so I might be giving myself a lot of birthday presents this week with Black Friday coming. So if I see a cute store on Etsy that has a sale on Black Friday I'm gonna get me a cute little hat um, because it's really cold in DC. Oh and I do like um, 
I have this like really cute Michael Kors scarf that's like leopard print that's a huge scarf you can actually put it over your head as a hood while using it as a uh, scarf it's super cute I don't have it right now it's in DC but I do like that for fall and it keeps the cold away um let's see favorite fall activity I like shopping I really really like shopping my mom and I make the rounds at the mall a lot when the um fall hits and we just like walk around and like window shop and look at decorations and um, you know cute stuff in the store so I definitely like doing that with my mom um, I like drinking apple cider I'm a huge apple cider fan so I drink apple cider whenever possible and um, I have a fireplace in my apartment but I don't use that bad boy but I like the idea of it but um, yeah oh and eating Jess me and you we are so yes I love eating my, since I'm not at home anymore like since I'm out of the house my mom only cooks on Thanksgiving and Christmas, and I love her food. So this is the season when I get to have my mom's cooking. So definitely looking forward to her turkey and stuffing and all that deliciousness and cabbage this Thursday. So um, those are some of my favorite fall activities. Um, any styles that I'm going to be planning on the next couple of months trying? Yes, definitely yes. Um, I love my braid outs and I love my twist outs, but I'm getting a little bored. Getting a little bored, so I want to experiment a little bit. Um, the last time that I straightened my hair was two years ago, actually, for my birthday, two years ago. So I'm a little curious about straightening, but straightening, but I think that I really want to give flexi rods another go. Um, every time that I've tried them, it's been like Shirley Temple meets somebody who's been lost in the woods for a while. So haven't had much luck with flexi rods. So I want to perfect my technique with that a little bit so I can get the kind of the sleekness of straightening without doing the whole flat ironing bit and still have like volume and curls so we'll see how that goes but definitely want to experiment with some new styles in the upcoming months I keep saying I want to do mini twists but every time I think about it I get intimidated and I get tired so I don't know about that but I'm definitely going to be experimenting with some new styles in the upcoming months so we'll see I'm still thinking about straightening but I'll keep you guys posted on that one um give one tip about fall winter hair tips um just definitely I would say sealing sealing has definitely been a game changer in my regimen um, after I get out the shower I apply my leave-in conditioner let that soak in for a little bit and then I apply butter to my hair and that makes a huge difference in keeping my hair moisturized for like days and days and days so um, I deep condition after every wash which I think is a huge component as well but if I had to give one tip I would definitely say sealing whether your hair likes butters or oils or um, just like a pomade or something just seal that moisture in after you get out of the shower definitely definitely recommend that and that's pretty much it um, it says to tag three other youtubers but I can't think of anybody who hasn't done the tag already or who's been tagged um, off the top of my head so I just want to tag all of you guys if you guys want to do this tag please feel free I would be really really excited to see your tag videos and um, leave it as a video response down below so yes ladies oh and this is my birthday hair this is just um, an old twist out that I wore in a bun last night and it gave me super stretchage stretchage yeah, I'm going to go with that stretchage. That's totally not a word. But yeah, I get to like enjoy my length today because the bun like stretched out my hair. So this is just a twist out. So yes, I think this feels like a really cute hairstyle to usher in my 26th year on this earth. So yeah, uh, that's the tag. I hope you guys do it and I will see you soon. Bye.